Jesus. And you may be seated if you have a seat. Tonight is a special night. And it's my joy to welcome the chairman of the Central Planning Committee of the Healing Jesus Campaign in our city here to bring us a word. Let's clap our hands for our chairman. Hallelujah! Amen. Sema Hallelujah! Let's clap our hands to Jesus. Yakuba wa mukozi wimana evangelist Doug Howard Mills. Honorable evangelist Doug Howard Mills. Yakuba wa musenyeri wa Igreza Anglicane. Honorable Bishop of the Anglican Church. Honorable Reverend. Pastori. Pastors. Church leaders. Uh, church, uh, God servant of the administration. <laughs> the congregation gathered here today. Let's. Hallelujah. Amen. <laughs> We have taken this opportunity to thank you so much. We don't have words to express our joy for the activities you have conducted here. You honored our province of Moyinga. You honored the servants of the Most High over here. In you honored the Most High, our God. You also honored yourselves. Let's clap for our evangelist, Doug Hwart Mills. Such activities have been conducted in the past, but not at this level. That's why you thank you so much. Let's thank those who lead us in the administration. That's the mayor of Moyinga. He has arrived here. This is the second day to be Let us clap for him. It's a sign that he loves us. And he has never refused any we have asked him. Thank you for facilitating us for each the activities we are conducting here. We didn't lack anything. And he didn't refuse anything to us for our We thank you so much. May God bless you abundantly. Let me give a special thanks to all churches that are here in Moyinga. Especially the churches who have worked together for the outcome of this crusade. Thank you for all that you have given your time. I know that you have worked day and night. But I thank you, but nobody among you is complaining. The most hard that you have served, let him bless you abundantly. Let me also thank all church leaders. They did all their best. They mobilized those who were under them. They gave themselves. They walked the night. They worked day and night for the good, in the good and bad season. And for that, we thank that the Most High will reward you. Let us thank them by clapping. I can't finish this word without... Uh, 
thanking those who came to support us for this day. We have so those who came from Ngozi. We have those who came from the Bujumbura. When they heard what was being done here in Moinga, they came and joined us. We thank you so much. May God bless you abundantly. Let me finish by this and asking evangelist Doug Howard Mills asking evangelist Doug Howard Mills please don't forget us. Whatever you are planning please think of coming back here in Moyinga. We we liked you, we loved you so much. We really, really rejoice in you. If you do this for us, it will be a great pleasure for us. Let us clap for him indeed. Let me end by here so that I give enough time. But also thanking every person present in this crusade. It was not easy. There was rain before. But what shows that you love God, you did your best through the rain and you arrived here. This also, God will bless you for it. <laughs> Hallelujah! Amen. Let me finish by saying yes, God loves, Jesus loves you and he cares about you. Let, me, let us clap for him. Hallelujah. Let's clap our hands for our chairman. Tonight we are also blessed to have the chief protocol officer of the first lady of the Republic of Burundi. Please join me with a hand clap to welcome the chief officer to give us a greeting. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Behind the hallelujah. Behind the hallelujah. I'm also happy to be part of this Jesus healing crusade happening here in Moyinga. You know also that we have given God the first priority here in our country. And you know that the family of His Excellency, the President of the Republic, is also conducting crusades throughout the year. Two times a year. Twice a year. Yes. I was also happy to come and join the servant of God. I knew him through the books he has written. And all the, the books he has written have, have blessed me so much. I, I, yeah, I was yearning saying to God why don't you give me an opportunity to, the, to see this great man of God and I'm happy to see him today physically let us clap for our God so welcome him in our country in Burundi and listen to him carefully an anointed man of God because, because through the books as I written and that I have read I felt the anointing of God coming upon me may God bless you abundantly Hallelujah!
Clap your hands for Jesus as we welcome Vivaldi to bless us. Simba, 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 Simba. Morita Guye. Morita Guye. Saverela, Saverela. Koma Mashi, Koma Mashi, Koma Mashi.
kuzina ya Yesu muvuge Yesu Yesu twarande sheje kuzina ya Yesu Gucha gucha kuzina ya Yesu Nivugu kuzina ya Yesu twarande sheje
Please make sure you write down the names of the of those who give their lives to Christ after the evangelist prays. Please write down the names of those who give their lives to Christ after the evangelist prays. 
Every counselor should be working tonight. It's very important you do this. But I believe that Moyinga is ready for what God is about to do tonight. We have experienced his power. For the past two nights. And on this final night, God is coming to you mightily with his power. He has anointed his servant who has ministered already in the past two days. And tonight the anointing is even at a higher level. Your life will not be the same again. Join me, Moinga, to welcome Evangelist. Lift up your hands. Father, thank you for tonight. Thank you for your mighty power that is at work. Here. Thank you for much salvation tonight. Thank you for healing. Thank you for changing the city of Muyinga. By your mighty power. Holy Spirit, we welcome you. Thank you for your mercies. In the name of Jesus. And everyone shouted, Amen. You may be seated if you have a seat. I want to first of all thank our pastors from Muyinga. For welcoming us warmly to your beautiful city. God bless you. And may all the churches in Muyinga grow a hundred times more. Amen. Amen. We also thank the government of Burundi for their support for this crusade. And we thank our chief protocol officer of the first lady. For gracing this occasion. God bless you, Mama. Amen. Amina. How many know that Burundi is a beautiful country? The only country I can compare it to is Switzerland. Because of your beautiful mountains and hills, Hallelujah. Amina. So we are very excited to be here with you. Tonight, I have a very simple message for you. In Hebrews chapter 9 and verse 27. It is appointed unto men once to die, but after this, the judgment. 
inyuma ko inyuma y'urupfu hariho urubanza it is appointed to man once to die and after dying judgment nokuvuga ngo ibi biraba umuntu agomba gupfa ariko inyuma y'ugo rupfu hakaba hariho urubanza now all of us have an appointment with death and with judgment rero twese uku utubona turafise igihe tuzohura nurupfu kandi tukongera tugahura nurubanza you cannot escape judgment yukuri urubanza nta nhamwe worukwepera and you cannot escape death nurupfu nago nyene ntushobora kurukwepa how many don't want to die how many want to die? How many don't want to die? If you don't want to die, lift your hand, please. What about on stage? You don't want to die. Well, sawa. I am sorry to tell you that you have an appointment. I don't know the date or the time, but it is an appointment you cannot escape. Ko ufise rendezvous yurupfu icho ntazi gusa no munsi ni tariki mugabo urafise rendezvous uzohura nurupfu utegereze wagupfa. Shh. Everybody say shh. Now, death Pero, is a bad thing, but it's also a good thing. Why is death also a good thing? Death, if there was no death, some of the bad people who have been in this world will still be alive and that will be a big problem. <laughs> so it is good that death has come to take away some of the people so that we have a new chance. Hey, hey. I want to tell you uh, something that happened. Do you know Nigeria? Do you know Nigeria? Murazi Nigeria. Murazi Nigeria. They hear about it. They heard about Nigeria. Yes. What about Ghana? Mbega Ghana yoyo. Murayiz. They hear about it. You've heard about it. Muro murayumba niko mbuzi. I'll tell you something happened in Nigeria. There was a, there was a rich man. Ngomba ndababwire ivyabaye muri Nigeria. Harabahe umugabo umutunzi. And he had a, a servant who was working for him and it was his best worker and this man was from Ghana. Yarafise umukozi yamukorera kandi yari umukozi mwiza cyane amukorera neza uwo mukozi wiwe nawe yava mu gihugu cha Ghana and Nigerians like Ghanaians because we are near to them kandi abanya Nigeria barakunda abanya Ghana kuko turababanye yes Ego. so um, one day the Nigerian big boss he sent his Worker, servant to the market to go and buy some things. Nero, umusume, wa mubosi umnyani Nigeria, aronjika wa mukozui wa umnyani Ghana mi soko, ajego sumi bimwe bimwe bimwe. So he was expecting that the man will take about three hours to buy all the things and come back, but within thirty minutes, the Ghanaian, the man from Ghana. Rush back to the house of the Nigerian rich man. Rero, yari yiteze ko 
ibya bintu amutumye gusuma aza kumara nk'iminota ita nk'amasaha 3 abisuma mugabo agize guca abona mu minota 30 arashitse muhira mu rugo gwa wa mutunze so the big boss from nigeria he saw the man from ghana and the man was shaking like this he was shaking rero wa mu boss wo muri nigeria agize guca abona wa mukozi wiwe ava muri ghana arashitse muri ya minota ari karadegedi wa nkuko adegedi so the nigerian big boss he asked his ghanian uh, servant why are you shaking so much and the ghanian man said when i went to the market i saw something that has frightened me i am too afraid there wa mu bi wa mu boss akomeye cyane wa muri nigeria aragira guca ramubaza wa mukozi wiwe ava muri gana ati none wabaye iki ko mbona udegedwa kandi cyane aca namubwira ati byukuri nyakubahwa aho nagiye na mwisoko nabonye ikintu gikomeye cyane cyane ubwoba do you want to know what the man saw in the market mega urifuza kumenya icyo uwo mugabo yabonye mwisoko Yes. Are you sure you want to know what he saw in the market? Byukuri, urumva ushaka kumenya icyo yabonye mu isoko? Yes. He said when I went to the market I saw a man called death. Death was in the market. Death. Yes. E arici amubwira ati igihe naja mu isoko. Nabonye urugabo runini rutayubwo baguhitwa Urupu. How do you say death? Urupu. Ulupu, Mr. Ulupu. Mr. Ulupu. Ah? Ya. Ya huyo na mushinga na Urupu. Urupu. Ulufu or Ulupu? Urupu. Ulufu. Yes. You are correct. Hey. Hey. So, Leru The Nigerian big boss said uh, you I, wh- why are you shaking so much and the Ghanaian man said no 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 I can't stay in Nigeria anymore I want to go to Ghana I want to go to Ghana now I can't stay here I'm afraid I saw Mr Ulufu in the market Wa mu bossi umu nya Nigeria arambye ati oya tsukuri nawe nuri kura ticket gura rengeje wa mugabo aramubwira toya nankana ubugu byukuri singishaka kuguma ngaha muri Nigeria ngomba ni yirukire ni subirira wacu muri Ghana kuko nahuye na mushinga ntahe urupfu so the Nigerian big boss took some money from the purse come come rero and he gave him some money rero the Ghanaian servant and he went immediately to the airport and he flew to Ghana because it's just 30 minutes to Ghana 30 minutes rero wa mu boss wo muri Nigeria yakeye geranya amafaranga arayazana arayahereza wa mukozi wiwe wo muri Ghana acharirukan kanano kugibuga cindege vu achara vutura no muri Ghana nurugenda ku minota 33 ugiye ni ndege uvuye muri Nigeria but when the Ghana man went the Nigerian big boss was sitting down in his room and he said no i will not let anybody cheat me so he decided to go to the market himself and face mr ulupu rero wa mu boss wo mu nyanigeria amaze kubona umko umukozi wiwe asubiye muri gana yaci asigara yiyumvira mu cyumba ciwe aravuga ati oya cewe prema nzenda rekabantu bambeje Oya nanje reka nigire mu isoko ndabicyo kigabo yabonye kitwa urupfu So the Nigerian big boss went to the market when he, when he got to the market do you know who he saw he saw Mr Ulufu Mr Ulufu or Ulufu standing in the market like this Rero wa mu boss akomeye cyane wo muri Nigeria yaci yahaguruka arasidu karagenda no mu isoko Hanyuma ageze mu isoko urazi ikintu yabonye yabonye gwa rugabo gurugatanya guhitwa urupfu ruhagaze nkuko 
And you know, Nigerians, they are not afraid of a lot of things. So the Nigerian big boss went to the Mr. Ulupu and said, <laughs> What do you mean by frightening my servant this afternoon? What do you mean? Who are you? I'm not afraid of you, Mr. Ulupu. <laughs> Do you want to know what Mr. Ulupu said back to the Nigerian big boss? Mbega, urumba wifu za kumenya, icho, wa mshinga nae, urufu, yishu ye, wa mbosu wiki tangazi. Are you sure you want to know? Tukururumfu, shaka kumimenya. He told him, when I saw your servant here this afternoon, I was wondering what he was doing here at this time because I have a meeting with him tonight in Ghana. I am meeting him in Ghana tonight, so I don't know why he is still in Nigeria by this time. Gwarufu, kwache guishwa wa mbosingo. Ahubgu, chewiki hena mbona nga haa. Apremidi, inyumayumu hinga mo. Ansanze nga hami isoko. Na tanga icho ajikora nga haa. Kukotu haitufta ni erandevu. Hari ya muri Ghana. Kuru yi mkoro wa nyeni. So the Ghanaian servant was rushing to meet his death in Ghana. You see, you cannot escape death when it is your turn. Lero, nukuvuka yuko, wa mkosi wa muri Ghana, wewe ya fashi ndeje yihuta, ajie guhura nuru fuku yiwe, kuru wa mkoroba. Urabana lero kutasha wala guhungurufu. Hey! So all of us have an appointment with Mr. Ulupu one day. Pero, tuese, atanu mavuye mo, turafita ni erandevu, numushinga nahe, urufu, umusungi. Hey! Hey! Now, in 50 years from now, 50 years. Pero, mumia kamirongi tanu, guheru yumusu, haru ye guheru yumusu, inia kamirongi tanu. Most of the people in this field will not be alive. Most of us will not be alive in 50 years. If you like, add 50 to your age, calculate and see. So tonight, everybody say, there is a question. What, what will happen to you when you die? This question cannot be answered in the university. It cannot be answered in any school. God so loved the world that he gave his only son who came to inform us what will happen to us when we die. Hey, hey. Jesus told us there was a certain rich man. Yesu who was clothed in purple and fine linen, like this man here. Come. The rich man was always wearing this color. Hey. He, he never wore clothes that were not expensive. Thank you. And he fed sumptuously every day. 
Can he ate good food, chicken, pork. Do you eat pork here? Yeah. Pork, yeah. chicken, mm. uh, beef. Yes. Goat. Shrimps. Shrimps. Shrimp. Yes. Goat. Fish. Fish. Goat. Goat. Every day. Yes. Can you mugabo? Yara ba ye ho neza. Yara damara ye. Kuko ya janeza. Yakura kura nyinyama. Uyumusa kajihene. Eja kajingurube. Hija eja kajinga. Hija eja eja kajinghoko. Gucho gucha kama kura kura nyagusu. Hey! Hey! And there was a beggar. Hanyuma. Hari ho umusezi. His name was Lazarus. Uwa yitu wa razaru. And this beggar, Hanyuma Omusezi, was put at the gate of the rich man. Yari kuirembo yama icha kuirembo jawa mutuns. The beggar was sleeping by the rich man's house. Omusezi, looking for food. Yaza yichara ase gari kumujango kuri portai jawa mutuns ase gasabinga. Chicken, asabing hoko. Goat. Magahene, fish, magafi, shrimps, imhaudu frit, bread, magakati. Hey, hey. And the and the and the poor man was really suffering. Kan if you kuri one mukene yara ba yihonar yari yara taste it. And the Bible says he was full of sores on his legs. Biblia kan di ifugayuko yari yuzu ye ibisebe umubiri wewe was. And every day the dogs. Do you have dogs in? Uh, yeah, yeah. Do you eat dog here? No. You don't eat it. Okay. No. <laughs> <laughs> the dogs were licking his sauce every day. Hanyuma i hari kuri wa mutunzi hari himbwa zamaziza zirigata ibisebe byiwe. He had no money to go to the to hospital, so the dogs were his nurses. Na kukata mahera ya rafise yo kujya kwivuza kwa muganga. Imga nizo zara ba foroma ba biwe. So one day the dog, the 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 poor man was sitting down. Ero umusume and he was feeling very cold. Umusume wa mucheni yari ita ye. The dogs have yuvimbe hanyishi eating part of his leg in the morning. Kuko imga zari za matano kujia inyama. The dogs have eaten part of his leg in the morning. And he was shaking. And Jesus told the story. The poor man died. Hey, hey. But the Bible says that then he was surrounded by angels. Angels came around him. Angels came around the poor man and carried him to Abraham's bosom to heaven. Hallelujah! How many want angels to come for you when you die? Hey, those upstairs, do you want angels to come for you? Now the rich man, he was not going to church. Always smoking. Drinking. Fooling. Doing bad things. One day, the rich man also died. Ha! Ha! Oh! Ah! Ah! And he died. Hey. Hey. Now, when he got up, no angels came for him. Instead of angels, the demons were coming for him. And demons, hey, hey, demons were coming. Oh, oh, oh no! Demons. 
came for this man. He started to pray, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Uh, but it was too late. He started to pray, Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. He started to say, I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth. Go away! Go away! And the demons took him. Come. They took the rich man. They took the rich man to hell. In Jesus' name, I refuse it. You know, this is what Jesus told us. Now, the rich man was in hell. And he was very thirsty. And he was suffering. Hey. Hey. And he saw Lazarus in heaven. Lazarus was sitting on his chair. Lazarus was on his chair. He was enjoying in heaven. He was drinking Coca-Cola in heaven. Because he has suffered in life. Angels were fanning him. Oh, nice angels. Ah. Oh, la, la. Lazarus was having a good time. But the rich man was in hell. Oh, angels. Come, angels. I like, I like angels. Ooh. Take a picture. I want to send a picture to Muyinga. Nasha can see photo in Muyinga. Hi, yeah. I what's up with you, Muyinga? Can you beg any kick check him? Hey, hey. But the rich man, Wamutuns, he was in hell. Yari Mumuriro. He was begging for water. Eh, Yakuma Sabotuns, Nguri Yamutuns. I just want one drop of water. Ati Yarabu Gango, Jensha, can you marry me? Gusa Yamat. Listen to me, my friend. Nyum Vidizan Chutianj. You have prisons in Burundi. But there is no prison like hell. Your prison in this country is like a hotel. Compared with hell. When you compare it with hell. Every prison in this world is like a hotel. The rich man was begging for one drop, just one drop. One drop. One drop. You know, since I was born, I have never gone to somebody's house to ask for one drop. One drop. No. Always you ask for bottle or glass. But not a drop, just a drop. How many want to go to this place? Hey, 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 Go where Lazarus went. Hey, hey. Now, the rich man, he said, Father Abraham, please send Lazarus to give me water. But Abraham said, sorry, no. 
ariko Abraham aramwishura ati mbabarira ndakwinginze ntibishoboka then he said please send Lazarus as an evangelist to go and evangelize my brother i have five brothers in Muyinga and Bujumbura they are just like me they will come here acha namubwira ati basi nimbi byo byase ndakwinginze basurungike Lazar mumuvuga batum agenda byira ubutumwa bene wacu basigaye batanu hari ha bari muyinga na bari bujumbura nabo bameze nkuko kwanje ndatinya ko bazo hava bansangino Abraham said no Abraham aravuga ati oya oya when no. you when you go to hell everything you ask for the answer is oya oya igihugiye mu muriro icyo usaba cyose inyishu yacho iba oya no hey hey if you make the mistake of going to hell anything you ask for water coca cola food air conditioner rice oya transportation you want a visit no oya 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 ni wa kori kosa jo kuja mu muri bidahera icyo zose abacyose aramazi ari fanta ari muceri ari gushaka ko abantu bagutemberera ikintu cyose uzoba wifuza inyishu yacu zoba ari oya 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 ni oya gusa oya 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 eh eh now abraham said rero abraham acharavuga ati your brothers your five brothers i will advise them to listen to the prophets the pastors the prophets erega bene wanyu batano uri kuravuga basigaye kwisi ahubwo je no bahanura yuko bokumviriza abavugishwa bari kwisi ari ba pastors nabakozi b'Imana prophets are supposed to preach about heaven and hell Buja abakozi b'Imana bategerezwa kuvuga ubutumwa mwijuru no mu muriro I am a prophet and everything I am telling you will happen Je wende mufugishwa kandi byo ndiko ndakubwira byose bizobaho Everything Icyo ndiko ndakubwira cyose bizobaho Everybody here is going to die everyone Umuntu wese ari hana zopfa uwe we wese Everybody here one day you'll be in a coffin Twese turi ngaho uwe ari we wese atisanga muri serkeye umunsi Everybody either angels will come and escort you to heaven or demons will take you to hell. Everybody. Buri muntu ari hano kimwe no kama marayika bazoza bakuyore bakujane mu ijuru cyane ibidayimoni biza bikuyore bikujane kuzimu muri rudahera. Twes ni kimwe muri ibyo bibiri. That's a true prophet. Ubwo rero nubuvugishwa by'ugukuri. Yes. Ego. A prophet is not preaching about money. Erego buvugishwa so kuvuga iby'amafaranga. By is preaching about Jesus. Ariko no kuvuga ibya Yesu Kristo. Hallelujah. Amina. Tonight, uyu mugoro God looked at us in Muyinga with such great eyes of love. Imana ituraba hani Muyinga ikoresheje amaso yayo yurukundo. And he said, how many people in Muyinga can come to heaven? with their own good works igacha ivugiti mbega nabantu bangahe bimuyinga bashobora kuzoza ngaha mwijuru kubera ibikogwa byabo byiza bakotse because my children whom i created they are all sinners kubera abana manje jewe naremye bose nabanyabyaha so god so loved the world that he gave his only son jesus christ so that anyone who believes in him will not have to perish in hell but will have everlasting life amen rero kubwo rukundo imana yakunze abari mwizi ariko gwatunye imana itanga umwana wayo wikinege kugira ngo mwizera wese ntazo pfera ubingwa je muri gihe no ahubwo azo yakira ubugingo budashira Hallelujah. Amen. How many want angels to come for you? Nibangaye bifuza kwa ba malaika bazoza kubatora. Do you know why God sent angels to come for Lazarus? 
Urazi igituma imana yararongisa bamana ikabakaza gutora Lazaro. It is because Lazarus was one of God's children. You see God sends his angels to come for his property. Nukubera yuko Lazaro yari umwe mu bana b'Imana. Rero Imana irongika bamana ika baze gutora ivyayo. Tonight, uyu mugoroba, how many of you want to be registered in heaven? That is why I came here. God sent me to warn you. It is appointed by all means, all of us, once to die. Number two, judgment. Some years ago, I didn't believe in Jesus. Or I just used to go to church. But I didn't know Jesus. But when I was in secondary school, somebody helped me to find Jesus Christ. Since then, I have been so happy that I found Jesus. Because I can see what he has saved me from. And so I want to tell so many people about this Jesus. Are you glad that you are hearing about this wonderful Jesus tonight? Yes. Jesus took the cup. Yes, we how are you going to save people, Jesus? With my blood. My blood. My blood. Hallelujah. Amen. One day, a man was going to um, England. Because his uncle was sick. The uncle was sick. So, somebody met him at the airport and he asked him that, what are you going to do for your uncle? The boy said, I am going to save my uncle. And the so they look at the boy and say, ah, you small boy, what can you do for your uncle? Do you know what the boy said? The boy said, my kidney, I'm going to donate my kidney for my, for my uncle. Yeah, I'm, I'm giving my kidney to save my uncle's life. So he was going to use his own kidney to save his uncle who had kidney failure. So when Jesus came to this world, people were asking, what are you going to use to save the people? And Jesus said, yes, I'm going Yeshua. to use my blood. My blood that is in my veins, I'm going to use my blood. Tonight, the blood of Jesus is flowing. I said the blood of Jesus is flowing from Calvary. To wash away all your sins. Do you want the blood of Jesus to wash your sins away? Do you want to follow Jesus from tonight? If you want to, the blood of Jesus to wash your sins, stand up with me everybody and lift your hand. Yes. 
and I'm going to pray with you. Say this prayer after me. Say, Lord Jesus. I cannot hear you. Say, Jesus. Thank you for tonight. Thank you for tonight. I have heard your word. It is appointed unto man once to die and after that judgment. Again. Oh Lord Jesus, please forgive me for my sins. Please wash me with the blood of Jesus. Oh Lord Jesus, have mercy on me. I am a sinner. I am a sinner. Wash me, Lord. Forgive me, Jesus. With your blood, I pray. Tonight, I open my heart. I receive Jesus. I receive Jesus. As my Savior and my Master. Please write my name. Please write my name in the book of life. Please write my name in the book of life. Now lift up your finger like this. Say after me, Satan. Listen carefully. From tonight, I bind you. Satan, I bind you. Satan, I reject you. Satan, I reject you. Satan, I refuse you. Satan, in the quick come Satan, I will not obey you again. Satan, is in zongera kukum virukundi. From tonight, I belong to Jesus. Where are you, Mugoro and Yesu? I belong to Jesus. Jendua Yesu. Now lift your two hands like this, everybody, upstairs, downstairs. Say, I love you, Jesus. I love you, Jesus. I thank you, Jesus. Thank you for dying for me. Thank you, Jesus, for loving me. Please write my name in the book of life. From tonight, I am born again. From tonight, I am born again. From tonight, I am a child of God. From tonight, I am born again. From tonight, I am born again. From tonight, I am born again.
from tonight I am a follower of Jesus Christ. Uhere mugoro bajendu ama kurikira Yesu Kristo. Thank you Lord. Nagushimiye mwami. Now wave your books, wave your books and your hand, everybody. Bogorero ni mudzuzu tutaba twanyu, turi mu biganza twanyu. Yes. Wave your hands and wave your books. Say thank you Jesus. Thank you Jesus. For what you've done for me. From tonight. I am your child. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now I want to pray for the sick. Whatever problem you have. Put your hand there right now. Jesus is healing you right now. Yes, Right now. Maybe pain in your back. Pain in your body. Pain in any part of you. Jesus is a healing Jesus. Jesus is a healing Jesus. Maybe you cannot see. Put your hand on your eyes. Maybe you cannot hear. Put your hand on your ears. Whatever your problem. Put your hand there right now. Jesus is healing you right now. Father, I thank you for many miracles tonight. Release your supernatural power. Release your supernatural power. Set everyone free tonight. Anyone who is tormented by demons Put your hand on your head I want to pray for you God is setting you free right now Satan Come out I bind you. I reject you. I cast you out. Come out in the name of Jesus. Come out in the name of Jesus. Come out in the name of Jesus. Be free in the name of Jesus. By the power of God. Everybody lift your hand. Tonight is the last night. Lift your hand and thank God. Thank God for his healing. Thank God for his blessing. Thank God for his deliverance. Thank God for his healing. In the name of Jesus. His power is here tonight. He is the Lord that healed us tonight. Je suis celui qui t'a guéri. Je suis celui qui t'a guéri. Oh, oh. J'envoie ma parole, tes maladies sont pris. Je suis celui qui t'a guéri. Tonight, wherever, wherever you are standing if God has touched you tonight check yourself right now whatever you couldn't do start to do it you couldn't see open your eyes you couldn't hear check your ears you had a pain check it right now something fantastic is happening now receive your healing right now wherever you are 
If God has done something for you, come to me right now from where you are standing. Come, I want to pray for you. I want to pray with you. Come, come. Come. Ingo. From wherever you are. Wherever you are. Maybe you, you had a problem. You can sense that God has done something for you. Wherever you are, just start coming to the front. Come, come to the crowd. Ingo, Ingo, Ingo. Come, Ingo. God is doing something wonderful. Here. Miracles are happening now. This is the moment of the miracle. Walk, walk from upstairs. From the side. From everywhere. God has done something for you. Come, Ingo. 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 Come. I want to pray for you. Something fantastic is happening right now. Hari chini chida sana chini kuchina kore kuwinye ni. Ushoze bima na mukawa kwa. Ingo, nimuze, nimuze. Mono aziko. Hari kitanga za. Hari <laughs> God has healed you tonight. Lift your hand. All over there. Let them come forward. The guy in the green. They are all at the back of the should come. Oh, I, 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 I,
Father, data, I pray for everybody here. Thank you. I pray for healing, Lord. Say I receive healing. I pray for peace. Receive peace. Father, I thank you for your power in everyone's life tonight. Whatever curse is working, I break it tonight in Jesus' name. I attack the strongholds of darkness in Muyinga province. Let a light shine in this city. Let a change come into this city. A supernatural change. By the power of God. Whatever is tormenting us in the house. When we go back to the house, the devil will bow to us in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, receive the peace of God. Receive the healing of God. Receive the life of God. Amen. Let the curse be taken away. Let a new blessing come here. After this crusade, let the light of Jesus shine forever. Like never before. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. To live a year, to Sabaroko, to Sabaroko, I am, 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 I but tonight when you prayed the power of God came over her she can see clearly without her glasses wow can you see clearly let her tell us what, tell yes. what happened I could not see people, many people without glasses. Wow. But when they prayed for me, after praying for me, now I can see many people, everyone in wow. Jesus' name. Thank you. Give the Lord a mighty shout of praise. <laughs> Doctor, what is 
Jesus. Evangelists pain from a snake bite. She was bitten by a snake yeah. and she had pain here. And a swelling. But the pain is gone after the evangelist prayed. When did the snake bite you? Vandred. On Friday. Snake bite on Friday. Yes. Is the pain gone? Pain is over now. Did, no she, did she see the snake? Sorry? Did she see the snake? Yes. What color was the snake? Yes. It was black. Black. Yes. Father, thank you for healing. Amen. Amen. Olivia, what is happening? Olivia, Evangelist, this little girl, four years ago, there was confusion in the house. She was what? There was confusion between the father and the mother. Right. And the father used a stick to break her hip. Because of that, she can show you how she used to. Ask her, how were you walking before you came here? Ask her. I, to show the evangelist. Ask her. Show her how to use So she was. Broken hip. Her hip was yeah. broken. Yes. Wow. And what happened tonight? Evangelist, after the prayer, the pain on the hip is gone and she is walking normally. I mean, wow. Now, tell her right now, after the healing, she should walk for the evangelist to see. All right. Come. All right. Come. Not how. Now, yes. tell her now. Okay. Gain the gain the trap. Ah. Wow. Okay. Will you move? Father, will you... thank you for your powerful healing of this yes. sick oh, Jesus. Jesus. Will you move? Oh, God. Yeah, just a thing that gira. Why me, Father? Are you coming? 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 Back pain has been healed tonight for five months. Five months. Will you move? Are you coming? Are you coming? Are you coming? Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Nanje nabonye igitangaza cy'Imana muri umugoroba. Tonight I saw the miracle of God. Maze ameza shikakura atanu ngwaye umugongo. It was 5 months with back pain. Naragerageje kwivuza, naranyuye imiti kwiye. I tried to go to different hospitals and take different medicines. Mugabo sinumva yuko mpize neze. But there there's no outcome. But yesterday I was here, it was difficult for me to stand up and to sit down. I, I could just get tired. Wow. But with faith, today I came earlier, then I sat here in front. Even to sit down on a chair, I would just feel tiredness and wow. pain. And I could feel even to stand up and walk around. But till now, I cannot feel any pain. No more pain. After, after praying, I felt too much peace in my body. Wow. And Amen. Doctor, what is this called? This is likely to be spondylosis of the lumbar spine. Pain 
from spondylosis. Huh. What is spondylosis of the lumbar spine? Is that what you interpreted? Ruti mumigongo. Evangelist, another severe back pain healed. He says he could not bend down to pick up a stone. He could not squat. But tonight, when you pray, wow. the pain has disappeared. Wow. Mufuga butunga. Ichini jitanga za chogu chiru mugongo chaba yekuno mugabo. Ni yashora kunama. Watori chini chiri hasi. Changen wateruri chini choba chiri hasi chire mele gache gache. Mugabo umaze kumusengera. Wow. Are you happy? Are you happy? Uranezere, Uranezere. Gender Nezere, which are Muganga, Jose Biranga, Mugawa Kupumuka to Mamaza Gusenga, Nagiza Gutio Numbutun, Kudu song, a two jet, Numba Jose Birahez, Wunhangor and Dashimiman. Wow. Olivia, what is this? Evangelist, he says that he was suffering from hemorrhoids. That when wow. he goes to Pupu, it comes out. He has to push it back. Wow. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to go to the so he said that this evening when you prayed, he felt that he had been healed. He went to the back, squid, <laughs> tried to poo -poo, to see if it will come out, and it didn't. It didn't come it out. It didn't come out for the first time. I he had it since he was a baby. Since he was a baby. Since he was a baby evangelist. I was a Wow. I, I am so happy to deliver that I am overwhelmed before God. I am overwhelmed before yes. God. Wow. Wow. Thank you, Thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Wow. Wow. Evangelist God is healing mental conditions here in Moinga. Movuga Butunga. Imiana Irikira Chiza Ibi Bazo Vijani Nimitwe. Hano in Moinga. Tell us. To be a Jenna Rinja Gushi Mirima. I am at the Miaka. I, I come to thank God because the mental problem attacked me when I was 16 years old. Now I am 33 years old. It was a pain for me because 
when he attacked me, it came by slow by slow. What has God done for her tonight? Okay. We must imagine I go to the church. I go to church. Yeah, I'm going to be thanking God. I go to church on a Sunday. I'm going to be thanking God. I go to church on a Sunday. I'm going to be thanking God. I go to church on a Sunday. I'm going to be thanking God. I go to church on a Sunday. I'm going to be thanking God. I go to church on a Sunday. I'm going to be thanking God. God has done me a miracle because yesterday when I come here I was mad but now I went back healed, healed totally She was mad Yes how and does she know how does she know she was mad yesterday Yeah she she, she said it before that uh, in these days she was mad it came it, it kept coming back coming back Jesus, thank you for your healing power, Lord. Yes, we never see me. Hallelujah. He gave the malady resuscitated. He gave the power to show you the change of heart. Dieu m'a fait des miracles, des miracles. Dieu m'a fait un coup. Evangelist, this young lady was deaf. She could only hear if you were very close to her. Wow. If you were far, she couldn't hear anything. But tonight when you prayed, Evangelist, her ears have opened. She wow. can hear everything clearly. Wow. 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 Are you happy tonight? I, I thank God for healing me tonight because this attacked me when I was 11 years old. Wow. Now I am 18. It was seven years old suffering from this, this death pain. Now I thank God for your, the healing that you brought here. Keep coming, please, in Jesus' name. Thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Olivia, what is this? Evangelist, Mama could not hear properly and she could also not see far. But after the prayer, she is seeing and even seeing the people on the hill. Are you happy tonight? So much. Why are you happy tonight? I am so happy because of this crusade. Wow. Wow. Amen. Yes. Many healings tonight. Yes. She's saying that she thanks God because of since on Friday when the campaign started. Yeah. She came. Then you said that you are going to pray for sick people, even those who are suffering from eyes problem. Mm. Then she took on her eyes. Then after praying, her eyes opened. She could see clearly people, even wow. the lights. Wow. Now, even the ears. Even the ears, she was somehow deaf. But now, she, could, she can hear clearly. Beautiful. Now, she's regretting because she has never gone to school. But she was learning if she can get an opportunity to study. Because her eyes are open now. Wow. <laughs> wow. The blessing. Wow. Thank, you, Thank you, Lord Jesus. How many of you would like me to pray for Financial healing, financial healing. Nibanga, Emily Nebke, Nifuza Yuko, Nova Sengera, 
ngo imani kabaha gukira mu buryo bw'amafaranga I am going to pray for financial healing ngiye kubasengera ngo imani bazanira gukira ikiye mu buryo bw'amafaranga This is how we are going to do it ukuniko rero tugiye kubikora Everybody quiet Buri muntu wese cecheke Everybody quiet Cecheka cecheka I am going to lead you to give a seed and I will pray over the seed for God to bless you Ngiye kubasaba ngo mubibe imbuto hanyuma nimwamara gutanga iyo mbuto yawe wazanye nje ndayisengera Imani cyikoresha I want you to give a seed of petrol to drive our convoy from Muyinga to Kayanza Kayanza petrol ndashaka ndabahe akaryo ko kubiba imbuto izo mbuto zanyu mubiba zishaka kuzokora kugura igitoro gitwara izi modoka kugyango zivi muyinga zishike mu Kayanza because we are going to Kayanza tomorrow Kuko ejo tuzocha tujja mu Kayanza. And God is going to do great things in Kayanza. Kandi mani zokora ibikomeye mu ntara ya Kayanza. How many believe that if you sow a seed to take us to Kayanza, God will give you a reward to take you to another good place. Ni bangahe muri mwebwe bizera ko ni wafata imbuto ya ukayibiba kugyango itujane dushikane mu Kayanza. Imani zo ikoresha ikaguheza giri kaguteza iyindi ntambwe Do you see this bucket here? Mbega murabona zino ndo hano. I'm going to put it in front. Ngomba nazishiteka hani mbere. Some of you may say we want to buy two gallons. What is gallon? Two gallon liters. Okay, okay, okay. Two gallon liters of uh, petrol. Okay, okay. Thank you. Benshi muri mwebwe mushobora kwibaza ngo tugomba tugure Someone will say I want to fill all your tanks for you. Hari huwe ndashobora kuvuga ati jewe ndashobora kuzuza imodoka ndumwe. Someone will say what I have is 1000. Uwonda gachavuga ati James igihumbi cyonyene. Everybody is going to give and I'm praying over your seat tonight. Uwari we wese agiye gutanga icafise hanyuma dusengere iyo mbuto ya uzo butanga. This one is for the people on stage. Iki ni cyaba bari ngaha kuri podium. In front here everybody from upstairs take your seat and let me pray for you now. Hanyuma ivyo biteretse ngaho hasi nabyo ni ivyo abantu bose bari ngaha imbere uhereye na bari yabari ku nkombe. Wow, we are still praying for the sick. Fati mbuto yawe uze uyibibe ngaha. Take out your offering. Everybody upstairs. Fati shikanwe yawe mwese uhereye na hari yahejuru ku nkombe. And you come to the front and put it in. Hanyuma muze muyiterere ngaha mu mbegeti. Lift it up, Father. Bless everyone that is giving tonight. Multiply their seeds. As they buy petrol and fuel, buy petrol and fuel and give them cars. In Jesus name I pray. Ah, mwami bagiye kugura igitoro kizi modoka zitushikana mu Kayanza. Nabuzo bahe kugura imodoka zabo mu izina rya Yesu. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Imani baheza gire. All right, let's continue. Come to the front and put your seed in the front. Evangelist, the power of God has healed this lady. She could not sit down without pain. Wow. And whenever she sat, it was difficult for her to get up. But tonight when we pray the power of God touched her. Evangelist, this woman can sit down now. Sit down. Ichara she can stand up it was difficult for her to stand up but, but the power of god touched her and she can now stand up without any pain aguruka turabe aguruka mvyeyi ah muvuga butumwa uyu mukenye thank you for your power yes shobora kwicara ngo bure kubabara mugabo buhu umaze kuzengera ari cara gahaguruka tangorane come and sow your financial seed god is going to bless you nimuze mu bibi mbuto zanyu ngaha imani baheza gire BDR. Evangelist, the power of God is healing back pain tonight. Wow. Ten, Ten, years of back pain. Ten years. Ten years of back pain. She, She has been healed miraculously tonight. 
Are you happy? Yes, I thank God because I could not move like this, but now I can move like move this. Move and let's see, move and let's see. To Zora, to Zora, to Zora, to Zora, Olivia, what is happening? Evangelist, a year and a half ago, he had a motor accident. And and so he's on painkillers. Wow. He had pain in the chest, in the hand. He could not move the hand well. Tonight, after the prayer, the pain has disappeared. The hand is okay. Thank you, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. God has healed this lady severe headaches and pain in the neck. She couldn't move, but the power of God touched her and she's healed tonight. Wow. Thank you, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Evangelist, wow. she couldn't bend. Wow. God is healing bones, yes. She bend couldn't bend. Let's see. Bend over, let's see. Bend she couldn't over, let's do see. that. Uh -huh. Are you, are you happy tonight? So much. So much. It was since the month of May, having this pain, back pain. I could not bend, I could not do nothing. Now I took different medicine. I went to different hospitals. Wow. Nothing happened. Wow. Now I, I was surprised that I can bend. Bend, let's see. Bend, let's see. Beautiful. Beautiful. Beautiful.